What happened to the conference room? Conference room? This isn't the conference room. What is it? This is our new innovation station. From now on, this is where we meet to innovate. To rethink the core processes of our organization. We're doing all that? Well, we haven't actually done it yet. But when we do do it, we have a place to do it. In. What are you guys doing? We're ideating. ID what? Ideating. What's that? Coming up with new ideas. Why don't you just call it that? This is different. We need to rethink the way we do things. Structure. Process. We need to innovate. How? We haven't ideated that yet. Good luck. Thanks. One of the top inventions of all time. Be the top 10 um, best inventions of all time in no particular order is um, electricity, the creation and distribution of it, penicillin. You know, without it, half of us would be dead. Um, 
the printing press. Gutenberg not only um, has enabled people to be literate, but he's really had uh, global implications in terms of how we communicate and our information. The telephone, I think, is a phenomenal invention. Airplanes and computing. Uh, the sonogram, which I know a lot of people don't realize, but the sonogram helps us locate fish, oil, and helps us monitor fetal development. That's a biggie. People don't realize that. That's the sneaker. Uh, cameras. Digital, in particular, I think is a phenomenal invention. Hydrogen cell fuel um, is phenomenal. And glasses for people to read. And the last one is iPod. Now, there's one other invention that was done in 1810 that was done by Peter Durand, and it was the metal camp. And I know people say, ah, Campbell Soup. Hello, that's just, that was invented in 1810. Up until that point, it was impossible to preserve foods. But one guy figured out a way to can and preserve food. And when that happened, you can see a direct correlation for supermarkets developing and people not getting us sick. And food distribution became a very huge industry. Without cans, we don't have supermarkets. What do you call that again? An avatar. A digital simulation of me in a virtual world. What's it do? Business. It's innovation. It's all the rage. I have my own island. Making any money on your island? Virtual money or, or actual money? The point of innovation is to make actual money. My avatar doesn't know how to do that. <laughs>